Hello guys, welcome to Vortex Programming. Today I'm going to be telling you how to convert a batch file to exe file and how to make an exe file run in background. That is how to make an invisible exe file. So the software which I use is for converting batch to exe files is uh, batch to exe. I'll just drop the link in the description below. Uh, it has a pretty neat interface as you can see. Uh, yeah. So uh, after downloading it, you don't need to install mm, this software because uh, it has a pre-installed exe version and you can just directly uh, run that file and start working with it so what you need to first do is uh, hit new surely you won't have any of these because i have created all of them so you hit new and over here we just need to type uh, a basic batch file so i'll just type at echo off uh, just give it a green color and just display something like hello there and and we'll I will add a pause. So let's run it in in a batch file version. Uh, I'll just give it um, a random name. I just gave it a random name actually. So after running it, as you can see, it displays hello there and press the key to continue as we had given a pause over here. So that's pretty good. So how do we convert this batch file into uh, an exe file? So uh, it's pretty simple. Uh, as you can see over here there is something called exe format and there are like four cases of four or four four options to select from uh, so I'll just select 64 bit it depends upon your operating system uh, whether it is 32 or 64 bit so mine is 64 bit so I'll just select uh, 64 bit console visible uh, I'll just select visible for now and let's hit convert and give it a random name it's not the best name for sure and uh, there you go uh, exe file is created and it is saved in the following directory so I'll just open it uh, it should be here uh, there you go so uh, before opening it I'll just show you the properties uh, there you go application.exe so I'll just run it and there you go the same result as you as we had uh, typed in the batch file so uh, how do we convert uh, this into an invisible exe file so that's also very easy surprisingly uh, over here just below this option we have another option that is 64 bit windows invisible so we just click that and we just hit on convert give it another name like random invisible um, that's good hit enter and there you go this is a random invisible file so before opening this file I will just uh, open my task manager to show you that my process is that this uh, exe file is running in background so uh, I'll just uh, hit enter and I should have uh, a process name um, what was the name a uh, random invisible uh, there you go random invisible so uh, uh, this program this exe file is running in background and it is not terminated yet as we had given a pause so until and unless it does not accept un until and unless it doesn't accept the character from the keyboard it will remain running like it will wait for a reply and all like that so therefore it's not terminating so this is how we can create an uh, exe file from a bad file and we can even convert that exe file to invisible format. So guys thank you for watching and please like and subscribe.